There is this stereotype that if you're a Filipino living abroad, you have a lot of money. And sometimes this can be true. You may probably earn more than the average salary here in the Philippines. But just because you're an overseas Filipino worker or OFW does not mean that life is instantly easy. Loneliness, homesickness, these are just among the emotional struggles of living abroad and no amount of money will ever replace being with your family. Or at least for me. As an alien in a foreign country, I constantly miss home. And one of the things that I like to do to remember my home country is to eat food. And luckily, I found an amazing Filipino restaurant in Thailand. Today, I'm excited to show you around Kalamansi Cafe. Kalamansi Cafe is a Filipino restaurant located in Saton 101-11, Tanon Suan Plu across Supala Elite. They are open from Wednesday to Monday at 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. and are closed every Tuesday. So this is uh, Kalamansi Cafe and I think it's a beautiful place to eat Filipino food and uh, if your timing is right, maybe meet some Filipinos as well. We have a very big group here with us today to celebrate Ruth and Alexi's wedding. So because we weren't able to attend their wedding in group one, we are celebrating here in Thailand with them. The restaurant's interior and exterior design is just absolutely classy and gorgeous. They have Filipino designs like the country's king of the road, the jeepney, a Filipino game called sunka, and even paintings of animals commonly found in the Philippines like the carabao and tarsier. What I also like about Kalamansi Cafe is that they have friendly Filipino staff. Hello, Kuya! Hello po, taga Cebu po ako. Pati ang server, ano, taga Silingan lang gihapon guys. Bisaya na gihapon. Yes, diba? Now that I've shown you around the place, let us now taste their food. Kalamansi Cafe has just about every Filipino food you're looking for. Their prices start at 90 baht per dish and can go as high as 400 baht. Not exactly the cheapest, but I honestly wouldn't mind paying extra for that authentic Filipino taste. We were actually invited to the restaurant by a relative of ours, Ruth, who recently got married in the Philippines and came to Thailand. These are the newlyweds, Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Lindstrom. Mm -hmm. Hi, can you please uh, introduce yourself to the So my name is Alexi Lindstrom. My name is Ruth. I'm young from yeah. Krabby Pips. <laughs> Krabby Pips, <laughs> Krabby Pips. Hello. My sister as usual. Hi. Hello, welcome to my vlog. For today's video, we are here celebrating Ruth and Alexi pre, I know, post wedding <laughs> celebration. Uh, hello, I'm Joanne. I'm Glory Lynn. You can call me Bonds for short. <laughs> uh, my name is Mark Jason Dominirago. I live in Talio, Burgos, Ilocos, or Philippines. Hi, I'm Pam. I'm Shai. I'm Shai. Hi, Shai. Hi, Shai. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Ruth and her Finnish husband, Alexi, treated us and her churchmates to a post-wedding celebration because we were not able to attend their wedding in the Philippines. Since we were a big group, we had the opportunity to order different dishes and taste them all. Lumpia. Alexi, this is your favorite, right? Lumpia? Yes, it yeah. is. What, what else is your favorite uh, Filipino food? Adobo. Adobo. Nice. And there's dessert, Biko. Biko? Biko. Yeah, yeah he's slowly turning into a Filipino foodie. <laughs> but Sinigang, yay! Yeah. Sinigang, no, 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 Sinigang. Sinigang, no. I make it without it. Uh-uh. Ano po yan? Labor spread. Labor spread. Tapos ano po yung inog? Akala ko kasi gerber. If you ask me, my favorite was the sisig and lumpia. My god. It was the taste of home.
If you want to bring Filipino frozen foods in dessert, Calamansi Cafe also has these for sale. May San Miguel San Miguel sa Thailand. Wow. Ito yung chicken liver. Oh, chicken liver? Okay, binibenta dito po yun. Ay, yes ma'am. Yun yung ano ma'am. Ay, yun. 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 Oh, at saka na na kimis. Ay, yun. Ay, yun. Oh, my God. Wow. May kuku. Oh, okay. Very Filipino food talaga, no? I love Filipino. If you're an OFW in Thailand, you understand the feeling of being away from the Philippines. Sometimes, restaurants like Kalamansi Cafe feel like a piece of home, and they take the loneliness away, even for a moment. Thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed the video and found great value in it. If you're a Filipino working abroad, I salute you for being courageous, and I pray you stay strong, whichever country you may be in. Hi! Hi! Please like and subscribe! Like, subscribe, and share! Yes! And congratulations to these two!